Hey it's Jaso here. Today I gave away almost 100 million loot for random players in Clash of Clans. But in reality none of that really was free. Because I built the strongest, the prettiest, the best, over 9000 IQ troll base. To tell the story from the beginning how it all started. Then in the March season your boy Jaso was crushing the top of the leaderboard and no one knew how to stop me. As the end of the season was approaching some rich boys with big bags of money paid for the most feared hitman to take down Jaso from the top of the leaderboard. Yes, one day when I woke up and opened Clash of Clans to admire my trophy count I saw an attack from the man Thanos himself. Everything he did was just one snap and my entire base was absolutely obliterated. Despite the deep depression it caused me I decided not to give up and come up with an idea how I can gain massive amount of trophies in the smallest amount of time. I was trying to come up with something and then I remembered. Yes guys, it was time to rebuild the free loot troll base. I needed to get as much gold and elixir as possible, so I sent out my best army, an army of the mightiest warriors, which was of course none other than the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle looking goblins. I gave them huge Santa bags and in couple of seconds they came back with some juicy gold and elixir that my evil mind was planning to use to bait in as many people as possible to gain some trophies to reclaim my number one spot at the top of the leaderboard. Once I had enough loot in my storages it was time to do the last thing, which was to build the troll base. But not just the exact same base as last year, but better, improved version of it. In matter of seconds the base was ready and it was time to remove the shield. While we are waiting there is something very important I have to quickly mention, which is the fact that over 80% of my viewers have not subscribed to the channel. Guys, no need to be afraid of pushing that red button. All what happens is that once every two weeks there will be one quality video in your subscription box that I have spent many many days working on. So if you enjoy my content be sure to subscribe. And it looks like I just received the first attack from a cow who decided to bring me 35 liters of milk. That happened to be exactly what I needed because I just ran out of milk to put in my cereal in the morning. Now that I had my milk and cereal it was time to relax and watch what kind of attack did the cow use to approach my ultimate troll base. Straight away I noticed that he brought some of those earthquake spells which completely makes sense as when cows walk then the ground shakes. Also I saw age spell, which means that it might be not so friendly cow coming near my village. But no problem, I had fence all around the base except the bottom right side. Somehow this cow had higher IQ than all the other cows and he didn't fell for my attempt to bait him into my fence with all the juicy loot at the doorway. Not only he didn't fell for the fence but this cow was so smart that he milked almost all of my elixir collectors and gold mines empty. But it's all okay because as already mentioned then he brought me 35 liters of milk so I can't be mad. Next up we had perhaps the most important attack to test the capabilities of the troll base. This attack decided if it's worthy of a name loot troll base, or not. While those goblins were relentlessly rushing towards the gold and elixir storages they had no idea that Jaso was prepared for this. As you can see I put the little Ares with their tiny swords in the clan castle so that they can cut some holes in all of the goblins gold bags. And as they were trying to grab some gold and throw it into the bag it all fell out again. So almost none of the loot went missing. Then there was moment of silence in memory of all the 260 fearless goblins who went out to die for nothing. Press F in the chat guys for all the poor goblins. But then something very shocking happened. An actual TV channel from China tried to steal my loot. After they put it in the news and asked me for an interview where I told them, subscribe to Jaso. When I thought that things can't go any worse I saw an attacker with 11 zap spells and can you guess where did he use them? Yes. On the storages. Someone please tell my guy whose name I can't read that zap spells do not work the way he is using them. Once the zap spell guy went away with empty pockets there came a new challenger from the clan dream killer with army of valkyries. Yes, the valkyries who love when buildings are stuck next to each other exactly like it was in my base. Not gonna lie at this point I was a bit afraid. As I saw valkyries running towards the base my blood pressure started rapidly increasing. But then I realized there is nothing to worry about because my dude slash just bought a new guitar that he can use to dig a little hole for the Valkyrie. 
As I was climbing higher in leagues better and better attackers started to attempt to beat my base. And here I put together a very short fail compilation how different kind of dragons and other troops are trying to defeat the ultimate loot troll base. Grab a cup of coffee or tea and enjoy. If you stayed all the way until the end of the video, then comment big troll, and I will randomly heart as many of those comments as I can. Also check out my playlist where I combine together all of my funniest videos. Yeah.